Hello and welcome to Nikolai's Genetics Lessons and today's problem is the following pedigrees represent the blood types in four unrelated families and in each case the parents have type A and type B blood. And this is exactly what we see here. One parent belongs to the blood group A, male parent, and another parent belongs to the blood group B, female parent. So question A. Which of the eight parents are definitely heterozygous for type O allele? And let's take a look at the first couple. Uh, we see that male belong to the blood group A and female belong to the blood group B. And in the progeny we have progeny that belong to the blood group O, blood group A and AB and also blood group B. And this is only possible if uh, male would be heterozygous and female also would be heterozygous and in this case we would see all these blood groups in their progeny. For example we would have blood group AB, we would have blood group B, we would have blood group A and we would have blood group O here. So one, two, three, four different blood, uh, blood types and this is exactly what we see here. Blood group O, A, A, B and B. So we can say that this male definitely belong to the genotype AO and female definitely belong to the genotype BO. And let's take a look here. Uh, can we say that this uh, male is heterozygous AO genotype and this female BO genotype and it is possible but we are not sure maybe this female uh, sorry this male is uh, homozygous for um, A allele and female B also can be homozygous for B allele or can be heterozygous anyway uh, in both cases uh, we would see uh, that they may have progeny that is going to be AB so uh, we are not sure, we cannot tell uh, for sure here, but let's compare with uh, another family here. Uh, all the progeny belong to the blood group AB. Most likely male is homozygous for the allele A and female is homozygous for the allele B and in this case only one blood type is possible in the progeny uh, that is going to be blood group AB but also it is possible that uh, one of the parents can be heterozygous can be for example AO we still would see uh, blood group AB but we also would see blood group B we do not see it here just because uh, the sample is not that large. But so far uh, it looks like genotype of the male is homozygous for the allele A and phenotype uh, genotype of the female homozygous for the allele B. And uh, once again if we would move to the fourth family we see also male belong to the blood group A, female belong to the blood group B and we see uh, that uh, some of the progeny belong to the blood group AB and some belong to the blood group B. And we can tell for sure that genotype of the male have to be um, allele A and allele O and female can be uh, allele B and also BO or can be um, B, B genotype. So what in this case we would see once again male genotype here on the top, female genotype here on the side and in the progeny in this case we would be able to see following genotypes and phenotypes. So blood group AB here, blood group AB here and blood group 
B here and blood group B here. So this is exactly what we see here. The children belong to the blood group AB and blood group B. So probably most likely genotype of the male AO and genotype of the female uh, BB. And as for this couple, as I said, uh, we can have here different variants. For example, male can be genotype AA, female can be BB. Uh, also, we can say that a male can be AO and female can be B or and different variants when for example male can be a o and, and female can be b b and uh, for example when male can be a a and female can be uh, b o in this case we just have uh, not enough statistical information so um, what is the second question question b uh, so once again we can definitely say that uh, individual uh, A would be heterozygous, individual B would be heterozygous, and individual A would be heterozygous. We can say it for sure. As for the rest, we cannot be that sure. And uh, question B, which of the eight parents are probably not heterozygous for the type or allele? And most likely this is parents 5 and 6 and maybe parent number 8. And the last question, can you be certain that the parents you named in the response to question B do not have type O allele? So is it possible uh, that uh, these parents uh, may have uh, O allele? So it can be AO or BO and yes it is possible. It is possible because uh, even when two parents would be heterozygous, one quarter uh, of the progeny would belong to the blood group AB. And it is possible that two children in a row would belong to this uh, blood group O3, O4, O5, O6. This is just a matter of uh, probability. If both parents would be homozygous, 100% of the progeny would be uh, blood group AB. But if both parents would be, say, heterozygous, like in this example, probability for them to have uh, six children, that is going to be blood group AB, would be one quarter multiplied by one quarter, multiplied by one quarter, multiplied by one quarter, multiplied by one quarter, and multiplied by one quarter. So we have to multiply all this independent probability. So as you see, um, it, there is some slight chance that both parents would be heterozygous, but probability that all six children would be uh, would belong to the blood group AB would be extremely small, about one out of four thousand. But still, in large populations, even such examples we can find. And this is all for today. Thank you for your attention. Please subscribe for my new videos that I post almost every day. Thumbs up if you like this video, please write your comments, questions if you have any, share this video with your classmates and see you in the next video. Goodbye.